welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for stopping in today. If you are new here, my name is Taylor. I post videos every Thursday all about thrifting, vintage, secondhand fashion, kind of mixing that with modern brands to hopefully inspire you guys to be bold and unique in creating your own sense of style. And today I'm super excited because we are going on like the most mega thrift day ever. I really haven't been thrifting that much since the stores have reopened. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna give myself a day and I'm claiming this as Taylor's big day out because I'm taking you guys thrifting for six hours. I'm just taking you all around some of my three favorite thrift stores in Nashville and I'm super excited. It's such a good one. I found so many good things. But before we jump into that, I want to introduce the sponsor for today's video. I'm so excited to be partnering with Green Chef today. Green Chef is a USDA organic certified company that makes eating well, easy and affordable with plans to fit every lifestyle. And that is one of the biggest reasons I love Green Chef and I'm so excited to work with them because they have a plant powered option. So they offer vegan or vegetarian. They also offer a bunch of other different types of plans for whatever lifestyle you have. So you could do keto, paleo, family. I think they have like a simply balanced option. There's so many choices for whatever lifestyle or dietary needs that you guys have. You can also switch up your meal plans every week. So if you wanna try being plant-based for a week, you could totally do that. Or maybe you wanna try paleo or keto, whatever it may be, Green Chef has got you. And it's really easy to just continue to follow whatever maybe dietary goals you might have or or lifestyle restrictions you might have. Right now, we've really been trying to go to the grocery store less and just cook at home more. So it's really nice to just let Green Chef do all the meal planning, grocery shopping, and a lot of the prepping during the week so that we don't have to. Today, we are going to actually be making a really, really yummy green pea falafel for dinner. I'm so excited because I love Mediterranean food. All recipes come with pre-measured sauces and spices so you can get more flavor and less time and I am so excited to dig into this green pea falafel with tahini. If you want to try Green Chef, you can use code TAYLORMADE60 to get $60 off your first three weeks, including free shipping on your first box with purchase. Go to greenchef.us slash TAYLORMADE60 to redeem and for more details. My husband and I have really enjoyed cooking Green Chef meals and it's been such a fun activity to do together while being stuck at home a lot right now. All the meals we've tried have seriously been so good and also super easy to prepare. Prepare. Again, if you want to try Green Chef, you can use code TAYLORMADE60 to get $60 off your first three weeks, including free shipping on your first box with purchase. Go to greenchef.us slash TAYLORMADE60 to redeem and for more details. All right, we are going to dig in and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Taylor's big day out! <laughs> the thrift store and I'm gonna start in one of my favorite sections which is dresses I know I always say that but it's always my first section so got to keep the tradition going I already see this dress popping out which is so cute little cherry dress kind of a ruched detail here and like flutter sleeves these are super trendy right now I'm really digging that like 90s early 2000s vibe right now so I'll definitely keep my eyes peeled from similar pieces to that dress but it looks like they have a really good selection today, which I'm excited about. It's usually not like one of my first stops, so I thought I'd switch it up a little bit and try something that's like a little out of my norm for me, just because I feel like I needed like a little bit of a change, you know? Like I went to my favorite thrift store last week and it was pretty picked over. So I'm like, you know what? Maybe you just need to switch things up. So let's get going through these dresses. I 
because I'm trying to avoid as many people as possible in the thrift store, there was somebody that was going around the other dress section that he needed to hit. So I figured I'll just head over to the shoes while I'm waiting for that to clear out. This thrift store is really nice because they actually organize their shoes by size, which most thrift stores um, do not. At least the Goodwills I go to do not. They're usually by color. So this is really nice. I can just hit up one quick section and then I won't have to look through all of the shoes. These are super cute little Anne Klein like kitten slingbacks, even though they're super cute. I've just been looking for stuff that's more casual, so. Ooh, these are cute. These sandals are really cute, but I feel like they're like a little too tight. My feet look like little sausages. <laughs> Didn't have any luck in the shoes, but I'm now back in the dresses. I already found one cute summer dress that has all, like, all these cocktails on it, and it's a bit beaded, so I just think this would be a fun like beach kind of cover up. I'm going on like a lake vacation for two weeks, which is, I'm just so excited to like be out of my house for a little bit. And I'll be really secluded, so we're basically just going to be like living in swimsuits for two weeks. So I'm definitely looking for a few things for that trip, and I think that dress could be like perfect as a beach cover up. One of the biggest things I'm looking for today are like summer bottoms, so like shorts and skirts, because. I, for some reason, don't have a lot of this, and I definitely want to look for some more like loungewear kind of shorts too, because that's, I don't know, what I've been gravitating towards recently. So, I'm gonna start in the shorts and see what we can find. the dresses and shorts so let me show you the things I found this is like an 80s or 90s dress and I've never seen anything like it, it has these two-toned floral detail here it has like this like peplum ruffle that goes all the way on the back and then it like ties in the front it's full-length maxi so I just think this is like unique and fun and I don't know I love a good floral dress this is a 90s plaid mini dress from Ann Taylor, and it has like this different brand that I've never seen from them before, Laundry from Ann Taylor. So I just love like 90s Ann Taylor stuff for some reason, and I love the plaid detail on this. The early 2000s cherry dress that I showed you with the flutter sleeves. The last dress I found is this midi length purple dress, probably 80s or 90s. It has this square print detail on here. And then the back is really nice because it has this kind of racer back with a, the back is really nice because it has this racer back detail with, oh my God, the back is super nice because it has this racer back detail with a bit of like a ruched back. So I think it'll be really flattering. And the only part I worry about is that it does do this like drop waist in the front which is sometimes not the most flattering on my body type but I really like the cut in the front I also found two pairs of vintage denim shorts the first are these cinched drawstring shorts and I haven't seen any like these with a drawstring in them so I think these will be super comfortable have a little bit of a wider leg which I like in shorts I don't like my shorts to be super tight because I think they're just super uncomfortable that way and then my girl Liz Claiborne coming through again these are a pair of vintage Liz Claiborne shorts I think these would be great either to just roll or like cut off into a raw hem now I'm going to head over to some of the tank tops and skirts since I'm looking for more of those summer items No skirts, but I'm in the tank top section now and I already found two really nice tank tops. I'm learning to embrace a good classic tank top and I just found this really nice 
like probably 90s and Klein tank top and it's in this really really nice like clay rust color. I've also really been into sweater tanks lately because I feel like they look a little more chic than just like a regular like cotton tank top and this is from one of my favorite brands to find at the thrift store because they make really really high quality knits. The brand is called August Silk. This one is a blend of viscose silk and nylon so it is a little bit stretchier and kind of slinky and again I really like this color it's like a nice contrast to this other orangish one I found so I'm gonna keep looking through these and see what other tank tops I can find. I've made my way over to some of the bags. They kind of have them spread out in different areas. The dressing rooms are closed by the way. And I found this really nice little leather backpack. It's like a miniature. It's in really good condition. They want $15 for it, which I feel like is a good deal, but I just don't need one. But I just thought this was a really nice like backpack. I love 80s like art deco kind of decor right now and this glass top like chrome table is so cool. It only has three chairs but it is sick. I don't need this piece but it's like an embroidered like shell shape and I just think that is so pretty. Alright, nothing in the art section so let's Keep going. This is something that I would buy just to put on like a coffee table or just like a regular table. It's made of marble and it's $3.99. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this houseware item. I really like it. I think it's actually made of like marble or onyx and I just love these on little tables. I'm picking up this cherry dress for $7.99. This silk and viscose blend shirt tank for $4.99. The 80s purple dress for $7.99. And this pair of vintage shorts for $4.99. So I'm gonna go pay for everything and then we'll head on to our next stop. Okay, I have my loot. I spent a little over $30 on all that stuff, which I feel like is really good. And now I'm going to head on over, I think to my next like favorite spot, Music City Thrift. I've taken you guys to this place so many times. So I'm gonna head on over there. We'll take you guys with me and hopefully they have some good stuff today. Um, and oh my, that was a bad idea. It's literally everywhere. Oh no, oh no. We're gonna have a lot of hand sanitizer, guys. Got my water. Bathed myself in hand sanitizer. Now let's go to Music City Thrift. I'm in the store now. I think I'm going to start in some of these shoes over here. This thrift store is like honestly very disorganized, but I think they've had a little bit of time to like get their shiz together a little bit. So I'm gonna start in some of these shoes over here. The other shoes are just like randomly placed on top of the racks in no order whatsoever. No <laughs> color coding or sizing or anything. But I think some of these seasonal shoes over here are. And then we'll move on to my favorite section, the dresses because we don't mess up a good routine, guys. They're a pair of like platform jellies. Let's see if they fit me. They fit me perfectly. You know how I feel about a good chunky sole. And these are so fabulous. I don't have any of these jelly sandals and I've been wanting a pair since I was like seven and had a pair of them and yes, they need to make a comeback. I'm low-key obsessed with these. They're definitely like an early 2000s, maybe late 90s little like Steve Madden block heel. Okay, what do we think? I mean, I know they're kind of crazy, but they're also kind of amazing at the same time. This is the type of shoe that I'm looking for. The square toe, like kind of flat mules. I just seem to wear these all the time in the summer just cause they're like easy to slip on, but these are both too big. So I snagged those two pairs of shoes and now I am over in the dress section because that's what we do. I had good luck in the shoes, so. Dress 
glasses. Not like a ton, but I'm trying to keep it pretty reeled in since I'm hitting up so many spots. First is this oversized t-shirt dress. It's actually from H&M original with the tags on there. I know this is definitely something that I would get a ton of wear out of and would look really sick with my docks. I also found this tropical print, like really long dress again kind of oversized this is a really really nice linen gray jumpsuit i don't think it's like anything special like it's probably not real linen because i've seen this brand before i think it's just like some online brand but i really like the fit of this this is a silk set so it has a tank with kind of a layered hem and then a skirt with a layered hem it is a size 10 so i think it might be a little bit big but i love these like silk sets in the summer so i'm gonna try it and see if it works the last thing i randomly found thrown in with the dresses was this polo shirt striped i love the orange and blue together and i was really drawn to it because it is vintage probably like 80s or something so um for three dollars i will definitely get this just to have for like next season i keep getting distracted by all of the shoes that are on the racks here so i figured i'm just gonna go through the whole store and just show you guys whatever shoes i find that are cool usually i find a bunch that aren't my size so i'll just show this to you anyways and then we'll move on to the skirts here Tops. I'm gonna look through here and see what we can find. much else the tank tops are pretty slim pickings but i did find this really kind of cool like marble tank top kind of sheer and then i found just some boring like lounge shorts that i have been looking for because i've been lounging obviously a lot in the house i've been here about two hours and i want to go ahead to my next stop so i'm going to look through this stuff and then we'll head on over to our third stop Let me give you a haul of everything I'm getting before we head to our third stop. I'm gonna pick up the mesh kind of marbled tee. I think this is only $2. The vintage striped polo shirt for $3. The oversized H&M t-shirt dress for $10. I know it's pricey, but I really like it. And I think this is definitely something I'm going to wear a ton of because What's more comfortable than just like an oversized t-shirt? I think the best things I got at this location though were the shoes. So I'm starting off with getting these Cole Haan orange and pink slides. I love these, love these colors and they are only $5.98. I mean, of course I have to get these. These are like my find of the day so far. Um, I just love them and I've always wanted a pair of jelly shoes and I love that these are platform and they're only $4.98. Last pair of shoes I'm gonna pick up are the Steve Madden block heels. I just love that heel and they're actually pretty comfortable for being so high. So these are only $5.98 as well. So that is all I will be picking up from this location and I gotta go check out and head for next stop. Whew. All right, it's so bright. I feel like I'm entering like an alternate universe when I come out of the thrift store. I spent, I think, a little over $30. We're in the car now. I just sanitized everything and I'm looking at my list of places that are open. Most thrift stores right now have pretty limited hours just so that they can clean a little extra. So most of them are closing at six or like Goodwill closes at five. So it's already 4.38, so Goodwill's out. So I think I'm gonna go to this other thrift store, Southern Thrift, which is another one of my favorites. Let's go ahead to Southern Thrift now. I'm gonna stock up on some water and then we'll go to our last and final stop. Stop three. 
are at our final stop, Southern Thrift. We only have an hour in here, so it's gonna be pretty quick. I'm gonna try to film as much as I can, but just because we're on a time crunch and I gotta sift through a lot of stuff because buyer's remorse, I'm just gonna do a super quick thrift and just show you things as I find them. We're over in the shoe section, which is where I usually start at this thrift store. And yeah, let's see if we can find any shoes. I just looked on the putback rack and found this really adorable vintage dress for only four dollars. Look how cute this dress is. It's an A-line floral. I really like it. It's super pretty. I love this. It is a Tommy Bahama, like rando, a midi length linen dress and this is what i've been looking for are these really nice linen dresses it's 10.99 which i feel like it's kind of steep for like a secondhand dress but this is really high quality it even has pockets and i've been searching for these like online thrifting and in her stores so hopefully this fits me look how adorable this little mini dress is i feel like hawaiian print is having a moment right now and this is such a nice flattering cut and very trendy with like the square neck so I'm gonna give this one a try I also like this dress it's like a long I don't know what brand it is because the tag is cut out what's left of the tag is old so it's only $4.59 these again are the types of dresses I just love wearing in the summer this is turning into like the most random thrift store trip ever I just went through like a bunch of swimsuits that they had but now I've got this <laughs> I think I'm gonna get this for our porch. It's kind of funny, but kind of cute. I also randomly found this little romper that has a rainbow stripe on the side. I thought it would be fun for lounging, just like something simple and comfortable. It's $6.59, so we'll see if I end up holding on to it at the end. I feel like it looks a little childish for me, but I also kind of dig that sometimes, so I think we're gonna head on over to the shorts now. like mega speed thrifting now <laughs> they just announced there's 30 minutes till the store closes and i know this thrift store is like when they're closing they are closing you better be gone i did find this like probably early 2000s victoria's secret top and these kind of like ruched tied up tops are really popular right now it might be a little bit big but i think it might also work it's giving me definitely like prairie romantic vibes so for $2.99 thought it was pretty good Woo! here is my final haul I decided to go ahead and get this top because it's only three dollars and I really like the pattern color style of it I'm picking up this floral vintage dress with this really nice collar on it and it is only $3.59 which is incredible. The last dress I am picking up is this long striped probably like 90s dress and this one is $4.59. And the random last thing I am getting is this little frog. That is the end. I'm gonna go check out and then we'll head home. My big day out was a huge success. And it just feels like good to be back thrifting again, you know? Okay, I officially reached hour six of thrifting. It was amazing. Honestly, like, I have been a caged animal during this time and I could like thrift for another six hours if the thrift stores are open. I hope you guys liked thrifting with me today. It was so fun to take you guys along with me for my big day out. I am super happy with everything I got and just felt like it was such a good day. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. I make thrifting videos every Thursday and I just hope you guys stick around. We have a good time over here. You can also follow me on Instagram if you want more thrifty content and see how I style up these thrift finds. And until next time, bye!